the winner advancing to the January 11 title game against either Clemson or Ohio State who face off in the Sugar Bowl. Davos Sweeney didn't think the Buckeyes played enough games to warrant top four consideration. We have reports from both games. Allison Williams is at the Rose Bowl, but we begin with Tom Rinaldi, who was at the Sugar Bowl. Tom? For all the talk of Ohio State's motivation, Clemson has plenty of its own in a simple mantra, start faster and play better. That's how the Tigers feel looking back at this performance a year ago in the semifinal. The Tigers fell behind 16-0 to the Buckeyes before ultimately rallying, marching 94 yards with a touchdown with less than two minutes to go to ultimately take the lead. In that game, Trevor Lawrence rushed for more than 100 yards, his feet providing a key spark. But as the Tigers arrive here in New Orleans later this afternoon, they understand they're going to have to play up to their highest standard if they wish to return to the national title game. Trevor Lawrence, he was the difference maker a year ago in this matchup against Ohio State. When you watch him, uh, granted, everybody talks about his arm. Yep. It's really his legs that have been the difference for Clemson in these big games. You're absolutely right, and Ohio State's defense has nightmares about Trevor Lawrence from last year in the Fiesta Bowl, but it's really the zone read game. That's where they get the advantage on the defense. Take a look at these plays, Kev. Here's where they outnumber the defense. You see Trevor, he sees man-to-man -man across the board. There's only five in the box. That means their linemen have plenty of guys to get them. There's nobody for the quarterback. The first guy for the quarterback is 10 yards downfield. That's not going to work. This is essentially triple option. Trevor has ability to throw that ball to the sideline if he wants to, but he loves to take these hits and he gets stronger as the game goes on. This is just an easy seal with the read option. Boom, if that guy crashes on the edge, Trevor's going to take it and there goes the tight end up and around ceiling for him. They overcommit, bad tackling angle, and there he goes again. This is what makes them so hard to defend because they have to account for the quarterback and now you're even matched on offense. You know, if you think about it, the game was back and forth. Clemson's offense was struggling a little bit. What they go to, they went to the zone read. So if I'm Ohio State, here's what I'm saying. We may lose this game, but I'm not going to allow Trevor Lawrence to rush for 100 yards. 16 carries, 107 yards. When the game was kind of in flux, it was indecisive, they put the ball in number 16's hands. Yeah. Guess what? If you're Ohio State, Sean Wade and those cornerbacks, they got to deal with Amari Rodgers. So it's going to be to the front seven of Ohio State. That front seven has to deal with Trevor Lawrence. If they can do that and they can limit Trevor Lawrence, you're not going to stop him. Stop him but limit him yep. where he doesn't take over the game, then Ohio State would go a long way to winning this game. That 67-yard touchdown in the second quarter, that was the turning point of that game in the Fiesta Bowl as we have a rematch here in two days. On New Year's Day, Clemson versus Ohio State in the All-State Sugar Bowl. And right now, Clemson favored by seven and a half points. It's Ryan Day's only loss in his career as the head coach of the Buckeyes a year ago. And then we got that first game, the Rose Bowl presented by Capital One. Guys, look at that spread. Alabama, <laughs> 19 and a half favorites, 19 and a half point favorites. Favorites. If that line holds, it would be the largest spread in playoff history. I think the game will be closer this year. This is not the Alabama that plays bully ball, and I think Notre Dame can score with this Alabama team. Okay. Notre Dame can put up points. Look out, Kev. We will see how this plays <laughs> out, of course, as our men behind the scenes, our great crew getting everything ready for New Year's Day from New Orleans. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.